Peso, please. It's obvious. Astral projecting is so much easier than you may think. If you follow these three steps, then you will most likely astral project with enough time and practice. Like a solar flare, yeah, we keep it bright. Take a look into the sky, yeah, I be taking flight. 2020 vision, everything gon' be alright. Ascending to new heights with my third eye. Elevate your frequency, ain't no other way to be. When we rise into 5e, feel the love strong. Open your chakras, can't lock to energy hot. Before we get into the video, I want you to realize that if you're trying to astral project, first, you should get pretty comfortable with meditating for long periods of time. You should get comfortable meditating for long periods of time and getting used to different states of consciousness. Once you get comfortable with different states of consciousness for a long time, now you're more able, you're more open to receiving you're more open to the experiences that you will encounter from astral projection. You have to realize that when it comes to astral projection, your thoughts can actually be reflected in your environment. So you have to understand these things because what you might find could shock you. It could even scare you, frighten you, could frighten you. So. Get used to getting yourself into a good mental place before trying to astral project. So step number one, do you meditate? Because meditation is one of the best ways that I astral project about 60 to 70% success rate, which, which I am basically getting right now. And so number one, the number one step is to get about six to seven hours of sleep. So if you get this much sleep, you're not going to be too tired and you're not going to be too alert. You're not going to be too alert. So this way you can get into those deep states of consciousness, which will help you astral project. So get six to seven hours of sleep. Now, when you wake up in the morning, you will get up and you will keep your mind active so you can wake up a little bit. So you're not too tired to attempt to astral project. So you're gonna wake up, you're gonna get up and do something. You can get some water, you can go to the bathroom, whatever you need to do. And actually, it's pretty cold outside right now, so if you go outside for a little bit, it'll really help wake you up because the cold weather will kind of be like a shock to your system. But that's good, this is good because you're waking up your mind, you're getting yourself ready to astral project. So after you've done this for quite some time, it doesn't have to be that long. For me, I usually just keep my mind active for about 10 to 15 minutes. If you've done this, then this is great because you can move on to the next step. Go to bed. So lay down in your bed. And for me, this is what I do. I meditate. All I do is really focus my awareness on my breath. I will just focus my awareness completely on my breath as I lay down. And at first it could be difficult, like you could be getting so many different thoughts, right? All these kinds of intrusive thoughts, but you can, as you persevere from it, as you persevere and you go for a quite extended period of time, like I'll usually meditate for an hour or more. and. Once I do, once I meditate this long, it helps me astral project so much easier because if I don't do it for this long, then I, it will sometimes become too difficult for me to get into those really deep states of consciousness. So you want to be in the borderline sleep state. Now that we know that going back to bed and laying down to meditate is step two. Number three is how we're gonna meditate. You're just going to focus your awareness completely on your breath. And that's basically it. If you are meditating for an extended period of time, like an hour or more, and you can completely concentrate on your breath, for that whole time, not exactly the whole time, because in the beginning, it can be difficult, right? But as you go on for an extended period of time and your awareness is completely on your breath and, and as you practice this more and more, it gets easier so that your thoughts 
will not be disturbed. So that your meditation and your awareness on your breath will not get disturbed. Now you may get to a certain state of consciousness where you hear vibrations or you can even feel your astral body in a space where your physical arm or leg isn't. And if you hear noises as well, then this is great because it means that you it means that you have started to separate from your physical body. If any of this starts happening, then what you need to do is to stay calm and do not analyze the situation. Don't think about the vibrations that you're feeling or any of the thoughts try not to think about it just let it be let it be that is the key to astral projection that is the key to astral projecting letting go and letting go of all fear that you may have with astral projection as well you just have to let go surrender and once you're in these deep states of consciousness and you feel these sensations, then you will most likely astral project, most likely. Sometimes it doesn't work completely, but the more you practice going through these three steps, then you will increase your chances of astral projection significantly. This is basically all I do. So let me repeat the steps real quick. Step one, six to seven hours of sleep and then get up, keep your mind active for a little bit. Number two, lay down and meditate. Number three, all I like to do is just focus my awareness on my breath. Some people also would like to just focus on the darkness behind their eyes or any or some other techniques but i'm telling you that what i do to get a pretty good success rate and actually projecting is just focusing my awareness on my breath and as this is all and then you might start to feel vibrations you might start to hear these vibrations and hear sounds but all you have to do is just let go trust the process let go of all fear and you will most likely ask to project don't forget that i meditate usually an hour or more and I start astral projecting around after the hour mark. So don't get discouraged if it's not happening right away. Practice meditating because it will get you closer. And this is basically all that you have to do. It doesn't have to be so complicated. It's so much easier than you think. My videos before help a lot of people astral project. So if you want to see more astral projection videos, subscribe and hit the notification bell. I have a lot more videos here and more to come. Peace out, please. Keep your mind at ease. It's obvious. Like a solar flare, yeah, we keep it bright. Take a look into the sky, yeah, I be taking flight. 2020 vision, everything gon' be alright. Ascending to new heights with my third eye. Elevate your frequency, ain't no other way to be. When we rise in the 5 e feel the love strong. Open your chakras, can't be locked to energy, huh?